turn my mic on. That's uh, that's kind of lame. All right, let's see if I can get up here to the uh, get up to the red. Well, almost to the red. Wow. All right. So welcome again to uh, Tibble's Apprentice. Luck of the draw. Welcome, welcome. Glad to see you there, Hexamal. How are you doing? Uh, so let's uh, let's gain some life here. We will send the indestructible one and send that one in. And um, they are playing red, so there's always the potential that I will take three points of damage at least. I am sorry that you are feeling annoyed, sir. Hopefully this will distract you momentarily and you can find some joy in the victory that I'm about to, to claim. We'll see if that actually happens. You might just be laughing at me as I make a foolish mistake and, and then suddenly lose the game. going to say, if you really need a distraction, I would be happy to uh, provide one by... Hmm, I don't like where that's going. I would be happy to uh, play you a game. I've got some light reading that I'd like to do, but uh, I always yeah, have time. Story my story one minute ago? It added to my story one minute ago. Okay. Wow, that's... Okay. And it just cycles through everything you posted recently. Okay. Lori is helping me figure out a little bit what's going on here on Facebook. Sort of. So if I block, or rather if I attack with this, he's going to block and have this grow to gigantic proportions. But I think I'm actually okay with that. There is one attack there. There is an attack here. Yeah, you'll always laugh at me. I, I, I know that, Hexamo. That's okay. I can laugh at me, too. Um, what are we going to do here? Let's get the damage in. And try to build that up beyond potential destruction. Oh. I would have thought that he would have blocked with the uh, first striker so he could buff up his... Whoops, I don't want to click on the wrong creature there. Uh, sure, why not pump one of these up, too? Okay, yeah, I would have thought that he would let this die so he could amass a little bit more. But he's got a plan. Ah, oh, there we go. Um, I think it might be too late, though. Ah, I see you should be working, sir. Well, that's fine. Perhaps later on. All right, this is more of a test to see if I'm losing any frames or anything. I believe that video is just beyond beyond the capability of my computer here. All right, so let us swing in with an attack. And then let's give each one of those a plus one. And put one there. And put one there. And there. And we'll say next. Hmm. Interesting that he chose to block with that. I would think, again, I would think he would block with a Grim Initiate. Allowing that other creature to grow. All right. And the turn. Well, I feel like I'm in a pretty safe place. And evidently he did too. Well, that... You think he's new like you. That's what Hexamal said. I, I'm going to disagree, sir, because he is choosing to play vintage. Excuse me, not vintage. What is this? This is historic. 
Historic doesn't go all the way back. Vintage lets you play all the cards. Historic, I want to say, lets you go back to... Is it 10th edition? I don't even know, really. Uh, let's, I, let's maybe look and see. Does it tell you? It won't tell you. Okay, here we go. It's going to... Yeah, no, doesn't tell you anything. Uh, you might not play that. Well, I might have a homebrew for you, sir. Or maybe not even a homebrew, but maybe a, maybe a net deck. Maybe a deck that you would enjoy. Well, let's watch this one get played one more time. We'll watch this play one more time. And you can see how easy it can be to pilot your way to victory. They're still, well, what's going on? Somebody cooking up some crawdaddies. Some crawdaddies. Ah. I see. Watching a friend from school doing a, doing a clam, I started to say a clam bake. I guess you just said that was crawdaddy, crawdaddy bake. Crawdaddy bake. Crawdaddy um. bake, so it's a, uh, hmm. All right. So actually what you're going to wind up watching here is a mirror match. You're saying they have beautiful hair because it's silver and gray like yours? Salt and pepper? Ah. Oh, that's not, uh, not cool. I mean, it's cool for them, but let's see. How... Do I go about this? Um, I need to outpace them on life. And I don't think I'm going to be able to. I think I need to get as much on the board as I possibly can. So we'll start with that. We'll start with this. This now is going to wind up being a long and boring game. Just after I ranked... Oh, they got black. So I'm going to give the advantage to them. They're going to have removal spells that I don't have. I will potentially have an ability to get creatures through unblocked because of... Because of... The ability to give them protection from white. And if he's playing a primarily white deck. Oh my gosh. That's a beautiful little mouse. Very cute. I'm thinking about building a Chandra deck. Okay. Um, that has some potential for sure. Um, I'm not sure in this format if Chandra's fast enough, but it'd be interesting to see. All right, now, what can we do here? Let's see. It's a race to build things up. And let's do it again. And there we go. Four, four. Mm, I probably should have put one on there so I could swing in with him. Um, that was my mistake. Well, I did tell you, you were fully welcome to watch me screw this up. Now I've given him a chance to gain more life. However, we'll see what kind of removal they have. Maybe they don't have any. Ah. That is beautiful. What is that? That's an Orthodox church you're looking at? Attacking with ball. Well, this one certainly is going to block here. And I'm sure they have some shenanigans up their sleeve. So... I'm going to take the hit. And let's see if they sweep the board. That's what I feel like is coming. Yes, that's what I thought. 
So, we're going to give something protection from white. So, we're going to tap this. Uh, it does, it does say destroy, so this should, this should save it. Um, pay one. Maybe not, though. In the meantime, that, yep, no getting around it. All right. Well, I'm going to have to do better than them. One, two, how many do I have? All right, I think I got this. Uh, we'll do this. Okay. Uh, let's put it on him. And put that on him. And let's do this. Just something to play with, I see. Something different, but not too different, maybe? All right. And let's do an attack. Let's get another build that way up there. Boom. All right. Ah, something different for you. Okay, I gotcha. Well, I don't like that. And I don't like that either. Too bad for me. All right, well, this makes things a little interesting. Let's see now. Let's build this up beyond something worth blocking. Let's attack with both of them. Let's build a... Hmm. Let's put one on there. And let's put one on here. All right. Give them something to think about. Put them, put them to a decision for their, for their creatures and their cards and their life. So I know that uh, Hexamal, you generally have an aggressive style of play. White here is letting you be aggressive and uh, just running that life total up, making it that much, excuse me, that much harder to kill. Mm. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Uh, target. Uh-oh, what does I see? Something in blue here. What is this? Interesting. Oh, and this comes back too, so. Oh, game over. All right. You like the deck I'm playing with. Well, this is a historic one. Hi there. Hi, you know the settlement I'm working on? Yes. How complicated it is and how long it's taking me, and I've barely scratched the surface on creating it. Yes. There's 30 of them. <laughs> My wife is a completionist, and she is playing Fallout. I think we're going to be busy for the next couple of years. I think I may not see the PS4 for a good long time. She just found out there were 30 settlements. And you've only been playing about a week, haven't you? Maybe. Yeah, about a week. So, yeah. Anyhow, getting back to that hexamol. Yes, this is a, a very nice deck. I will pass it on uh, if you choose. Actually, I'll take a quick look at it right here. Um, it is pretty much one of the things that's dominating the meta right now. And uh, with good reason. I made a slight tweak to it based on a loss that I suffered earlier today. But it was only a slight t uh, net. I put net on it because I wanted to know it's a net deck. It's not an original brew. However, I have. It wasn't called Life Smash either. Um, I just knew that's what I was going to be doing with it. Um, it just has all your, your low... One and done creatures here. I put in a soul ward. No, the soul ward was maybe already there. I'm not sure. What did I put in? Uh, I threw in the Nyx Fleece Ram. That automatic life gain at the beginning of the turn makes a difference. Um, so tweaking it based on a couple of cards that I did or didn't have. Um, some Luminous Brood Moths. 
and uh, is this will not play in in normal uh, because it has cards that are um, much older. Soul Warden and the Nyx the Nyx Fleece Ram, and um, this as you see is from ten M ten. Um, you can get these cards. It's a common card. It's not a big deal. Whenever another creature enters, gain one life. Um, M19. So yeah, because of the older cards, it is not one that you can... Um, it is not one that you... You okay? My wife hurt herself. Walking out of the room. Sad. Um, yeah, they are nice creatures. They're low to the ground. They give you an advantage. Um, I am susceptible, but historic, exactly. So depending on what they are playing, I mean, it can be beaten, I'm sure. But uh, since historic also, or is now, um, helps you climb the ladder. No, she didn't lose an arm. I think she lost a toe. Yeah, she has problems stumbling into things. That's her drinking. I'm just kidding. That's terrible. Anybody actually hearing that is going to... Well, never mind. Uh, yeah, so... Where are we at here? Should I play one more? I'll leave it up to you. I should probably. You should probably get back to work. You should got nine more toes. Yeah, not a problem. <laughs> she can do that nine more times. Uh, she just does it four more times. I'll just find her walking in a circle, probably. Should I play one more? Or should I let you play one more? Okay. Let's see what we can do. Let's where are we at? We are Ah, uh, I'm gonna lose that and wind up at plat well, we'll see. That's okay. Here we go. One more. And then I play twelve more games. All right. I should be filming a new Tibbles Apprentice. I was going to do a new Cruel Realities where I talk about Talk about the magic collection that I am trying to grow. This is not good. Not having more mana than this. Um, I've got first turn, second turn, third turn plays. But I'm going to mulligan. All right. That's better. That is, that is better. First three plays... I can see them. I go first. I should look at that before I'm actually clicking on the cards. I don't. Anyhow, I'm trying to be, after 25 years or more, I am trying to be a better player. I think that's an interesting question there. It's where... Uh, where are you in your journey as far as, yeah, see, I don't, you notice everything that I'm playing here is, is against white, has some kind of white in it. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, white is popular at this point. Uh, going to murder something. No. All right, well, let's, uh. See what I can do here. This is going to give me plenty of life, but um, I'll go here and here. I wish I was getting some more value out of that. But at this point, I'm going to have to build up as much as I can because obviously they're going to go for life gain also. Black, white, or straight white. Uh, I have seen some aggro red in this. Um, mm, okay. I do at least have the advantage of knowing... That at some point I can slip something in by giving it protection. But dang it, that is just not helping me right now. Um, I'm going to gain some more life. But I've got me a, 
It's got me blocked in until I get a better, until I get something else. Ah. Okay. Well, this is why we liked having the uh, having that companion in that deck to be able to bring bring critters back, but ah, uh, she is legendary. I can gain a life. All right, so what what do I do here? Ah, nothing. If I wind up with some kind of a board wipe or something, I can try to recover. Ah, there we go. Yep. Dang it, Hexamol, you made me play a game and now I'm going to lose. <laughs> I'm joking, of course. Boom. All right. There has got to be a way around this. I just got to draw into it. That will help also. Nothing to apologize for there, sir. That is that is fine. I just need to think. I need to I need to think my way around this. Not sorry. I didn't think you were. Um all right. Five. Oh, I got kisses. <laughs> and now they're gonna smell like taste like peanut butter. Hexamal said you have nine more toes, so you could stub them again, I guess. Um, oh, oh, it was your elbow. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh. Oh, sh I gotcha. Uh, no. Answer. Mm, mm, mm. What am I missing? This is simple and straightforward. Oh, yep, she stubbed her elbow. Um, this is, yeah, see, oh, you son of a... All right, so. Eh. All right. Ah. Well, I'm glad I did that because would that have been, uh, yeah, that would have been creature. So I'm glad I thought I had to do that. All right. So they're coming in. Got blockers. I've got blockers. He's got some shenanigans up his sleeve here. Um, or maybe he doesn't. I don't know. I'm going to take it. No blocks. And now he's going to wipe the board. And now I'm going to be glad that I kept this. No? Okay. Ah, oh, brutal. What the... What the heck? Well... <laughs> you don't like this person. I guess you're the only one that should be beating up on me, right? Well, I knew this was a glass cannon, so... All right. Oh, and you give him vigilance. Nice. All right. Come on over. Really? And they tell me, they tell me the shuffler is not broken. Uh, so, I'm not getting any other benefit out of these guys, so let's do this. Oh, it gives a death touch. Well, I already lost this one. So, this isn't probably the best example, but uh, it does work pretty well, so... Yeah, you got me. I'm not sure why. Somebody muted me. Have I been muted because I've said good game too many times? Maybe. All right, you got me. Well, 
Do I keep my ranking? Do I drop down to Platinum 3? Let's see. Most importantly, most impressively, I did not drop any frames for this. Let's check in my rank here. Nope, still Platinum Tier 2. All right. That's fine. Uh, usually takes me much longer in the month to get to that level. Uh, I will... As a matter of fact, sir, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to export this for you right now. All right, sir. Thank you very much for watching me. To anybody else? Oh, you're getting closer. Nice. I like that. You're uh, just a matter of time before you fill that in. Only two more balls on your mastery pass. I'm jealous. Something I will, it's an achievement I will never make. <laughs> uh, I suppose at some point I can spend the money and get a mastery pass perhaps once. At any rate, uh, as I was saying to anybody else that may have been watching, um, did that thing air out? Oh. Um, to anybody else that may have been watching, you got to catch me on Twitch TV where I can actually see your text. Uh, in the meantime, oh, you've got four more to go. I missed that on your, you sent me a picture through Discord of the, no, you don't. looks like you only have two. I mean, you know better than I do. Oh, there's another one inside there. I see you do have four more to go. Well, good luck, sir. Perhaps we will play later. And to anybody else that might be watching, look for Tibble's Apprentice on Facebook and on YouTube. We'll be getting back to doing more Commander stuff soon. But in the meantime, I'm going to end stream.